Well, welcome back to We Are City channel, and what a way to start today's episode. It is Champions League quarterfinal action away from home, going away to Catalonia to face Barcelona in this Champions League quarterfinal second leg. Manchester City take on a very, very successful side in Barcelona in this competition. Five time Champions League winners, and Pep Guardiola's side play there with his return back to his former side, his boyhood club, and he's hoping to come away with a win and Manchester City booking themselves tickets to the semi-finals of this season's Champions League tournament. Here is Rafinha, Ilkay Gundogan. Gundogan through towards Lewandowski, Rafinha, Rafinha, Rafinha with a dipping shot. Tipped away by Edison. In to go Martinez. Poor pass, can fit Odin get the end of it. And Aujo works it wide to Balde. Lamin Yamal, Gundogan back in behind to young Yamal. Here he is, Frimpong against him, can't... Beat him physically, wins it, does he? No, Lamal gets it back. Crossing by Lewin Yamal. There is Lewandowski, saved onto the boot of Rafinha. And Barcelona leading the Champions League. That is 3-2, they lead in aggregate as well with that one. They lead 1-0 on the night. Celebrations by goalkeeper Marc-Andre Ter Stegen. With his surrounding teammates, Lamin Yamal celebrates with Rafinha, Ilkay Gundogan, Balde. Robert Lewandowski, good cross in by Lewin Yamal. It's a good header by Lewandowski as well, he heads it low. Edison has to parry it away. But it's not enough, is it? Slow to react is Kevin De Bruyne, who's back there. And it's Rafinha, the resilient, who scores and gives Barcelona a lead in the Champions League. Bad start for Manchester City. Really bad start. All through by Barcelona. Again, Lewandowski. He looks so dangerous here. Yamal. Cross in. Lamin Yamal with a header. Big save by Edison behind for a corner. What a chance for Barcelona here. What a start in this one. It's Ilkay Gundogan in the wide area. Balde swings it in. Yamal's arriving. Good header. Big save from Edison. Big save. Well, he said on his far side. Last chance to loom for Manchester City this first half. Pull back to Kevin Yorona. Good touch and strike. Into the hands of Mark andre to Stegen. And that will be half time in the Champions League here at the camp now. Manchester City 1 0 down the night and 3 2 down aggregate. So a very good Barcelona side. They've scored a very good goal. City have got it all to do. No second 45 minutes here in Catalonia. Second half underway and City pushing straight away at the start of it. Elise through to Foden. Phil Foden. Foden goes with his right foot. Why is he not going with the left foot there, Phil Foden? If he goes with the left foot, he can bend that to the far post. Past Mark andre to Stegen. Instead, Foden's gone with the right foot. What a silly decision. What a silly decision. Elise. Grealish. Alvarez, nice turn. Elise. Michael Elise. City back level 3 3. Big goal from Michael Elise. Brilliant strike from the Frenchman. We've said before he's gone from Champions League to Champions League knockout round football. When he was playing Championship football not long ago, he was playing relegation fight football with Crystal Palace. He's now a key member of this Manchester City side off that right hand side. Great play from Michael Elise. Brilliant turn from Julian Alvarez. And Elise into the bottom corner. And he gives Manchester City that equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Frimpong. Foden. De Bruyne makes a run. 1-1. One, one. Kevin De Bruyne. Big save by Ter Stegen at that near post. De Bruyne should score that. City have missed too many chances in this tie. It's a big miss from De Bruyne really. Good save from Ter Stegen. Here's De Bruyne. Grealish. Alvarez. No turn here. Julian. Alvarez. Blocked. Oh, and he flex wide. Well, Haaland's on now. Not fully fit, Erling Haaland. He's struggled with injuries at times this season. Still our top goal scorer. Good strike from Alvarez. He flex and just past the Stegen's post. So unlucky for Alvarez. So, so unlucky. Barcelona goes short with Gundogan to Lewandowski. Lewandowski towards Vita Roque. Roque with a touch and turn. Vita Roque! Bends it into the bottom corner as a Brazilian. And Barcelona... Take the lead to the Champions League quarter-final. Brilliant finish from Vita Roque on the turn. Very good finish from the Brazilian. Stone should win that. Lewandowski composed. Roque on the turn. Past Diaz. Into the bottom corner. City's defence not strong enough. And Barcelona breach it. What a turn by Roque. What a finish. Bends it in there. And it's a no chance. City behind and look like they're out. Vita Roque. Lewandowski, through to Rafinha, he's clear on the through here, Rafinha, 
On to Edison. Manchester City. Lucky that wasn't five there. He Roy on the turn. Last chance to loom for City. Doku. Great spin. Doku. Brilliant football. Doku into Haaland. Defended away by Araujo. Back to Rodri. Rodri with a strike over the mark. Full-time whistle goes. And Manchester City crash out of the Champions League in the quarter-final stage. Goals from Rafinha and Vita Roque. 2-1 on the night. 4-3 on aggregate. Manchester City are out of the Champions League. Barcelona goes to the semi-finals. And Manchester City... And Pep Guardiola's side cannot be happy with their performance in front of goal that knocks them out. Whilst that massive disappointment against Barcelona Champions League, City gets straight back into Premier League action, looking to chase the only possible trophy they can win this season, which is the Premier League title. Be knocked out of the FA Cup, be knocked out of the Champions League. Now, Manchester City take on Ipswich at home at the Etihad today. And I feel a little bit sorry for Ipswich because we are going to be in a bad mood and look to take our frustrations on a pretty weak Ipswich side, to be honest with you. Here is Ipswich, and City win it back through Stones and Roderick. Great physicality, Stones, good intensity from Manchester City in that midfield. Stones into Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne through to Erling Carlin. First chance of the game. Early goal for City in the 15th minute. And Kevin De Bruyne finds Erling Carlin. 1-0 in the Premier League. Well, City looking to score some goals today. Looking for a strong response to that. Poor result to Barcelona in midweek, which knocks out the Champions League. Great ball by De Bruyne, a fine talent, one touch, one touch finish as well. Easy for Erling Carlin, a man of his quality. And again, him and De Bruyne combine again. De Bruyne, the master of finding passes and finding space and finding that killer pass. City looking to start quickly in the second half. Here's Phil Foden, past the challenges, Foden through to Haaland. Haaland holds it up. Mateo Kovacic played out wide. Kovacic back in towards Miguel Gutierrez. De Bruyne arriving, De Bruyne, bends one! What a finish by Kevin De Bruyne. 2-0 Manchester City at the Etihad. But we are going to take our frustrations out on Luton Town here today, unfortunately for them. And that's a great finish by Kevin De Bruyne. Bends it to the far post. No stopping that one for the goalkeeper. Looked like he'd overhit it here, Harlan. But he pulls it, Kovacic pulls it back to Gutierrez. And what a fine by De Bruyne. Bends it towards that bottom corner. It's a brilliant finish of high quality. And he pulls it off, does Kevin De Bruyne. It's really nicely done. Manchester City 2, hit switch 0. No. Here's Mateus Nunes off the bench. Mateus Nunes, good strike. Big save by the keeper, back out. Throwing Manchester City. Michael Lisi to throw it in here. Back towards Walker. Mateus Nunes. Hit by Mateus Nunes. Off the post and in. What a strike from our midfield powerhouse. He's like a, an energizer bunny, Mateus Nunes. He picks up that ball, he turns and he drives, it seems. Great physicality, a really energetic player. One that can do the hard yards, can get up and down the field. And he's done it there. He likes to turn and drive. This time it's played to an edge of the box. Right place at the right time. And a really good strike, actually. One touch, bang. Off the post and at the near post. A different one for the keeper, keeper to save. Mateus Nunes finds the back of the net. Ready for it. Asks it off Kyle Walker, sees the space, rolls it onto his, his weaker left foot, hits it in that top corner. Walker, 81 minutes on the clock, City pushing again. Ortega, not in that City side today. Edison's the one who's helping with the build up. Mateus Nunes to Jeremy Doku. Doku! Onto Haaland, one touch, 4 0. Brilliant for Manchester City. Absolutely spectacular from City on the counter again. A second for Erling Carlin today. Really good play. City working so well. And City punish this Ipswich side. 4-0 Manchester City now. And towards the end of this game, City really pushing for Mateus Nunes, great drive. Through to Doku. Composed. Back to Haaland. One touch. Taps it in. Slides it in the back of the net. The keepers come springing across to try and keep that one out. Thinking Haaland might go across him. But Haaland goes back to where the keepers come from. And he's composed as well here, Haaland. He takes a touch as well. One touch under his spell. Back of the net. Down by Stones to pack start. City are going to open up Ipswich again here. Doku. Great touches by Jeremy Doku. Mateus Nunes to the far left of him. He finds Mateus Nunes. Mateus Nunes for Manchester City. Off the bench and gets a double. 5-0 Manchester City. What an impact Mateus Nunes had in this game. Off the bench. And a double for the... The Portuguese midfielder, really good play. Found by Doku, and Mateus Nunes bends it to that far post. Really, really good finish. 
5-0 Manchester City. What an impact he's made. What an impact he's made off the bench. Maybe should be starting more games for us. Really good play. Again, one touch, gets it onto his foot and then finishes it. This pack it out. Final few moments of the game here. And Mateusz Nunes is away again. And here's Mateusz Nunes. Mateusz Nunes. Haaland. Back to Mateusz Nunes. Mateusz Nunes! Off the bench in about the 70th minute. And he gets himself a hat-trick. Three goals today for City's midfield powerhouse, Mateusz Nunes. And Ipswich is 6-0 down to the current champions, but I don't think they'll be champions coming in the season. Good play with Haaland, back to him. What a hit in the bottom corner. Fair play to Mateusz Nunes, that's really good play. Very positive from the midfielder. Back to him by Haaland again, one touch sets himself. And the second touch is a really good finish. What a goal. Free kick right at the end of this one to be taken by Lucas Paqueta over the bar by the Brazilian full-time Manchester City 6, Ipswich Town 0. Great performance from Manchester City, especially in that second half, especially towards the end of the game. And that by Mateusz Nunes off the bench into midfield for Mateo Kovacic. So aggressive, so good. And he goes and gets himself a hat-trick. What a performance from City. Great response to Barcelona. Well, it's a big win for us in the Premier League. Not going to make much difference though unless Spurs drop points. United won by one goal to nil. Liverpool win 1-0. Villa win 1-0. And Tottenham win by one goal to nil against Brighton. Spurs, the best defensive record in the Premier League. And they continue that match day 33. Four points separate us and Spurs. The Premier League is all we've got to play for now. So we've got to do our best to try and win it. More Premier League action. Manchester City chasing down that Tottenham Hotspur side in this title race. Looking to try and win this title despite looking like it's against all odds. Southampton in our way today, a newly promoted side. Their intention is to tear them apart. Here is Southampton and Mateusz Nunes. Brilliant from him again. Mateusz Nunes, that midfield. Jeremy Doku. City attack quickly in the first four minutes. Doku through to Haaland here. Haaland in the first few minutes. Erling Haaland. Five minutes in and Manchester City lead by one goal to the St Mary's. Matthias Nunes, who has been so, so good in our midfield, the midfield powerhouse. Him and Doku combine. Doku wins it and he's away, Jeremy Doku. And he feeds Erling Haaland. It's an easy tap in with the outside of the left boot. Pass Gavin Bazunu. Alex McCarthy it is today, no Bazunu. City lead at St Mary's. Southampton behind and this Manchester City side are absolutely flying in the Premier League. Trying to respond to that really poor Champions League performance. Long by Southampton. Finds Kevin De Bruyne. Diaz, Joshko Vardiol, oh he's been robbed here Vardiol, big mistake, Fraser, Fraser across to Suleimana, back into Fraser, chance for Southampton, what a strike by Ryan Fraser, 1-1, one, one. well that's a against the script isn't it, against what we expected, against the runner play certainly, Southampton equalised through Ryan Fraser, the former Bournemouth and Newcastle United man, with a brilliant goal there, hit it, struck it so well, Joshko Vardiel makes a mistake for Manchester City. And Southampton pounce instantly. Ryan Fraser, great finish. Soliman at Walker Peters. Stuart Armstrong is there as well. Just some of the players. That's a really bad mistake by Vardiel. Armstrong nicks at the cap. Oh, Fraser nicks it. Back to Soliman. And then Fraser, first time hitting the right foot. Rifles it past Edison. Matthias Nunes. Oh my word. Brilliant again. He's just bullying the Southampton midfield. Pushes them off. Mateusz Nunes. Brilliant. Off he goes again. Mateusz Nunes. Outside the boot. Pass through to Jeremy Doku. Doku onto Haaland. What a goal from Manchester City. Two on me lead. What a goal that is. Mateusz Nunes has become one of my favourite players in these last, these last few episodes. What a turn. Physically an absolute monster. Outside the boot. Ball through towards Doku. Takes it to the far post. What a ball to Haaland. Doku and Haaland combine again. It's 2-1 Manchester City back in front. What a ball by Doku. What a bit of play from Mateusz Nunes. And Erling Haaland with a perfect finish. Here's Jeremy Doku. Mateusz Nunes. Wide to Phil Foden. Frimpong on the overlap. Frimpong. Frimpong into Jeremy Doku. Brilliant finish by Doku. Well, he adds a goal to his two assists already today, Jeremy Doku. With a great finish. Storming at the far post. Well, fist across the box by Jeremy Frimpong. And there is Doku, the Belgian. There to tap it in. Puts it to the side netting as well. Interesting finish, actually. Puts it really far wide to that side netting. Nice finish by Doku. 3-1 Manchester City. Brilliant finish by Doku. Great attacking play by Frimpong. City very much in front. 
and City now, I think all three points are heading our way with Pep Guardiola's side. Hakisar on the swing in for the corner. Alvarez with the header, falls to Diaz, he flicks it. And somehow, that's gone up and over the bar. Ball comes in, Alvarez in. Diaz, he's flicked over the bar. Here's Mateusz Nunes. Spins, Frimpong. Frimpong with a cross in, blocked away. Manning, nicked by Olise. Pakatar, great feet. Mateusz Nunes, he's in again here, Mateusz Nunes. Well, he's just absolutely on fire in front of goal. Is the midfielder. And he makes it 4 on Manchester City. Really good finish. Cross blocked. Mistake by Manny. Elise's across to it. Into Pakatar. Great feet into Nates Nunes. One touch again. And his weaker left foot hammers it. Hammers it into the back of the net. No chance for Keith McCarthy. Manchester City make it 4. And we've certainly responded after that Barcelona. Disappointing. Crushing defeat in the Champions League. His stones away towards Alvarez. Full-time whistle goes. Manchester City. A 4-1 win away from home at Southampton. A big result for the City side. Who continue to try and chase down Tottenham Hotspur. In this very, very tight title race. Well, it feels like we've made too many mistakes in the Premier League this season. But a 4-1 win over Southampton on match day 34. Leaves us still within four points. Maybe going into the last four games of the Premier League season. Spurs... They have won again. 1-0 against Fulham. How many 1-0 wins to Spurs this season? Just keep doing it time and time again. They still stay four points clear at the top of that Premier League table. We'll keep pushing. Otherwise, we'll finish this season trophy-less. So Premier League action continues to Manchester City. At home today against West Ham United. They're having a really good season. And actually sit around 6th or 7th place, I think, don't they, in the Premier League table. Manchester City got it all to do. Mateus Nunes starts once again, a midfielder in scintillating form, alongside Jeremy Doku and, of course, Erling Haaland. This is a fantastic City side. Here's Rodri. Fires one wide to Grealish early on here for City. Grealish into the box. Grealish tries to pull it back. Mateus Nunes is in great goal-scoring form. But what a save from Alphonse Areola here. Mateus Nunes so frustrated with himself. Looking for what would be his fifth goal in the last three games. Grealish does so well to pick this one up. On the spin. Big save. Fantastic save by Ariola. Wide to Mateus Nunes. Wide towards Grealish. Great space for Ake. Nathan Ake. Haaland found. Haaland against Mavropanos. Good skill from Haaland. What a goal from Erling Haaland. That's surely 30 in the Premier League now. For Erling Haaland. Great finish by... The big Norwegian. City have got the pressure off them, really. The pressure's on Spurs to see how they do. They keep picking up 1-0 wins and defending so well. We've just got to try and win our games and hope Spurs drop points. Great finish from Erling Haaland on the spin. Physically, absolutely bullies the Greek. Centre-back and former Arsenal man Mavropanos turns away from him. On a weaker right foot, smashes it in the back of the net to give City the lead here. Here's West Ham United through Bergvine. Bergvine forward. Bergvine. Good skill by Bergvine. Tackle by Kyle Walker. Fly got the ball there, Kyle Walker. Referee says no, it's a foul. And there's some talk about this perhaps being in the box. It was in the box. Penalty West Ham. Up steps Captain James Ward-Prowse against Edison. Off the crossbar by Ward-Prowse. And away by Ake. Edison went the wrong way as well. Mateus Nunes onto Grealish. Grealish tackle by Sofal. Warprouse, nicked by Foden. Foden one and one. Big save by Ariola again. How is Phil Foden not scored there? Great play again by City. Pressing the pass. Foden wins it back. But he's got to score. Another good save from Ariola. Here's Mateus Nunes. Into Phil Foden. It rolls all the way through to Jack Rich to Haaland. Haaland with a strike off the crossbar. Off the crossbar and somehow he's not in the back of the net. How City only scored one goal today. Half time. Manchester City won. West Ham nil. West Ham hit the crossbar as well from a penalty through James Ward Prowse. An exciting game at the Etihad here. Grealish. Haaland's in space here. Haaland lays it off. Bernardo Silva. Over the bar. I don't know what he's doing when he's come up to take that one, Bernardo. That is full time. Another win for Manchester City. Big win. 1 0 win. Good football today. I don't know how City haven't scored more. I don't know how West haven't scored either. 
Hound celebrates with the fans here. Manchester City 1, West Ham United 0. City stay on the tail of Spurs. And I don't think it's going to be enough. Well, City do the business again. City pick up three points again. But Tottenham Hotspur, how do they do? 3-0 win for Liverpool there. Spurs win 1-0 again. What is it with these 1-0 wins for Spurs? 1-0 win over Brentford this time away from home. Their defence is spectacular. I mean, look at that. Goals against 27. I mean, not more, actually, many more than us, but Spurs continue to do it. Still four points off it with three games remaining. We need them to desperately drop points. Southampton, Bournemouth, Fulham right near the bottom. Everton could be dragged into that as well. So final game of today's episode. More Premier League action. We go away to the Emirates Stadium to face Arsenal. They were once in the title race at the start of this season. They dropped off in the end. Manchester City got the better of them a few times. And it is City versus Arsenal, Guardiola versus Arteta, and some key battles in there. Odegaard versus De Bruyne, Edison versus Riot. We've got Diaz against Saliba, Rice against Rodri, Haaland against Ivan Toni. That is who their striker is. A very good signing for them. And a very good Arsenal look inside there. Really good look inside, really, in terms of quality. Here's De Bruyne, Jeremy Doku. Off to Phil Foden, Why right to Elise. Nice touches. Frimpong on the overlap. Jeremy Frimpong. Ball in. How will it start this one? Over the bar by Erling Carlin. Good chance for City. That's a really good chance for Erling. Good play by City. Elise gets it onto the overlapping. Frimpong puts it on a plate for Allen, who's the wrong side of Saliba. Over the bar. Mateus Nunes wide towards Elise. Again, Frimpong on the overlap. Sinchenko can't control him. Frimpong. Another ball in towards Haaland. Haaland again! Oh! Just wide of the post by Erling Carland. I thought that was dipping in. Good play by City. Elise in behind to Frimpong. Once again, the same move works. Zinchenko the weakness. So City pushing this second half. Arsenal have hardly touched the ball. And City coming out very quick out the blocks. Jeremy Doku, what a run. Into towards Elise. Back to Doku. Nice play from City. Doku waiting for Frimpong again. Zinchenko's all over the place. Frimpong with the ball in. Haaland with the header. On to Raya. Back to Haaland. What a block by Arsenal. Again, Frimpong swings it into Haaland. It's onto the head of the big Norwegian. Great header save by Riot. And he looks to hit the tap in and it's off Gabriel. Bad ball to De Bruyne. But a big mistake by Saliba. And it's pounced upon by De Bruyne. And Erling Haaland save by the keeper. Pakatar on the rebound. 1-0 Manchester City lead the Emirates. And it's Lucas Pakatar. What a sign he has been. So, so fantastic for us. So fantastic. And proving it once again there. Pouncing on that opportunity. Big mistake by Gabriel at the back here after poor ball by Elise. Oh, it's Saliba. De Bruyne on it. Haaland can't score. But there is Lucas Pakatar. In for the rebound. Back of the net. And Manchester City lead the Emirates by one goal to nil. Don't know how Haaland hasn't scored this one, really. Raya with another good save. Pakatar pounces. Arsenal forward. Cross in. Chance for Tony. Good chance for Ivan Tony. Former Brentford man with a really good opportunity there with a the header. But it's over the bar. Free kick taken quickly. In by Tommy Asu. Ivan Tony just over the bar. Very, very good chance. He's frustrated with himself. Here's Mateus Nunes driving forward. Final moments of the game here for Manchester City. Mateus Nunes. Good ball wide to Phil Foden, who skips away from Zinchenko, his former teammate Phil Foden, and puts it into the bottom corner to finish this game off if it wasn't already over. This late stage is Manchester City, 2-0 winners at the Emirates, and they start to stream out here, the fans, here in London. What a finish by Phil Foden, great play by City star boy, who's outshone. The Arsenal man, Bakayo Saka today. Saka hardly involved. A frustrated Gabriel there at the back. Another really good finish by Phil Foden. Great play. Well, two games remain in this Premier League season after this one. Spurs don't look like they're going to drop it. It looks like Spurs won't bottle it. They will win the Premier League title. City are going to go trophyless. We've really performed so well at the end of the season. I wish we could have kept this consistently up throughout the season and in all games. I want it to go further in the Champions League. I want it to go further in the FA Cup. And I want it to win the Premier League. Things don't always work out the way you want them to. And silly results in silly games. I mean, really, some really bad results this season in, in stupid situations have cost us. But uh, towards the end of the season here, we really have performed. There's been some really standout performers. 
brilliant goal by Phil Foden, who makes it 2-0 Manchester City. Ivan Tony kicks it off. The full-time whistle goes. Arsenal 0, Manchester City 2. Big win at the Emirates for Manchester City. They go into the last two games of the season behind Spurs, but maybe just too far off them to lift that Premier League title come the end of the season. Well, that ends today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. City with a really good record, barring being knocked out of the Champions League in this month. But Spurs win 1-0 again, this time over Aston Villa. The 1-0 Masters. Spurs stay top four points clear. Two games remain in the final episode. Who knows what will happen? Thanks for watching. Please let me know if you haven't already. Please subscribe if you're new. We'll see you next time.